Hello. In this quick video, we're going to look at the VLOOKUP function and the index match function in Excel, so we can look at a certain value in one column, then find its corresponding value in another column. Just a quick note on these formulas. If you get the following error, it means that the regional settings of your computer require a semicolon here instead of a comma. I'll note those instances throughout the video. Okay, so let's get to it. Here we've got a list of states. And on another sheet, we have the states in reverse alphabetical order, as well as their abbreviations. So back in our first sheet, we're going to pull that abbreviation data over using VLOOKUP. But when we do so, we have to pull from a list that is sorted A to Z, which ours is not. So let's see what happens. First we'll type in equals, VLOOKUP, parenthesis, we'll select our first state here, Alabama, comma or semicolon, and for the table array, we'll come to our second sheet and hold down the shift key so we can click on and select both of these columns. We want VLOOKUP to locate the same state value, that is Alabama in sheet 1, and we'd like it to locate Alabama in sheet 2. Then we want it to give us the results for that Alabama's column B, comma or semicolon. Then for the column number, there's columns 1 and 2 here. As we said, we want the results from column 2, the abbreviation close parenthesis, and enter. And we'll get an error in our formula here, which will be corrected once we sort our list in sheet 2 from A to Z. And now we can highlight the top cell and click the small square icon to run the formula on the rest of the data. Now a slightly better and more accurate way to do all this is to use match index, which doesn't care how the list is sorted. Let's delete this column we created in our first sheet. And back on sheet 2, let's cut out Alabama, which we'll use for our demo, and paste it randomly somewhere else here. Now in sheet 1, we'll type equals, match, parenthesis, We'll ask it to find the data in A1, comma or semicolon, and to look for it in sheet 2, column A, comma or semicolon, and for the match type to be exact, or zero. Close parenthesis, and enter. And it tells us that Alabama is in the 29th row in sheet 2. So now we'll add the index function to our match formula. We'll insert index, parenthesis, and for the array, we want it to pull back column B from our second sheet, comma or semicolon. The row number is the match result formula here, comma or semicolon. And we'd like it to pull it back from column 1. Close parenthesis, enter. And we get the abbreviation for Alabama, even though it was out of order on the list. And double-click the square to get the results for the other cells.